G'day, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Draw with Jazza. I'm Jazza, I'm and Jayden. I'm here with oh, Jaden. There, I came in no, too early. That's all right. That's all right. I gave you no warning. Everyone. I just inserted myself. <laughs> so we're drawing. We're sketching each other's avatar. We're using a program called Draw Pile. We can draw at the same time. And at the moment, we're sketching each other's avatar. So I'm on the right sketching Jaden, and she's on the left sketching me. I'm drawing you. Oh, I, we're both doing it so accurately. Yep. This is exactly how you draw your avatar all the time. All right. Let's swap. You do the lines of y your Oh, you're a ghost. Character. I didn't have time to draw legs, so you're a ghost. Yep, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so over on Jaden's channel, we've uh, we've just had the pleasure of, of uh, appealing to a bunch of different audiences. So we're going to continue our, our mission to create a collab that literally appeals to everyone on the planet. I got like oven mitts. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just, I'm holding shards of glass. <laughs> and you're like, wow, this is painful. <laughs> this was a terrible idea. I'm spoop, spoopy. I'm oven mitts. Yours turned out so much better than mine. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I think it's pretty to. similar. <laughs> I feel like this is my new actual like avatar. You have to make that. If you make that your Twitter icon, I'll make this my <laughs> Twitter icon. <laughs> All right, deal, done. There we go, much better. Okay. Okay, there you go. Profile picture saved. Save changes. Oh, you did it already? This is called having a, a an appealing brand identity. <laughs> we want to make. This is what <laughs> sponsorships look like. Exactly. For. Professionalism. <laughs> exactly. Man, yours is like actually good. This is so unfair. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. There we go. You, no, it's too late. You have a uh, smell lines. Uh, no, you did. Ah! Yeah, you. Should we start the actual? Yeah, we now? should probably. <laughs> We should probably make content. All right, let's 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 appeal to, to audiences. All right, you, you start us off. Who have we not appealed to? Obviously so far we've like kind of covered most bases. Um, we haven't appealed to children. Let's do mm. something like child friendly. That's a good idea. Keep it family friendly. I oh, you just, this... you're just sketching on my side now? Is oh wait, that... I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky for you, I'm looking at an empty space here. <laughs> All right, we're gonna create a children's toy. It's important that children's toy are safe and not chokeable. So big, squidgy shapes are generally a good idea. They'll find a way of, to hurt themselves with anything. Exactly. That is actually true. That, like, <laughs> no, I'm not kidding. Like, I have a toddler, and his game, he climbs onto the, the highest surfaces he can find and jumps off of them. Sounds fun. And Daddy's gonna run and catch me. Sounds fun. I can't wait to have kids. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Let's swap. Sweet. Uh, mine is a pig based on George Orwell's Animal Farm, which is a, a statement on communism. Oh, really? Yeah. Mine's so just a normal cow. Yours mean. comes with like an educational message and mine's just like, hey, it's a cow. <laughs> <laughs> At least I'm appealing to people who like Animal Farm. That's that's a demographic, right? S I think so. <laughs> is there a demographic that doesn't like udders on cows? Yeah, probably religious people. It's okay. They're happy udders. He needs pants. Nah. <laughs> this also appeals to nudists. I feel like I've ruined my toy. I don't think anyone will buy this. So I win. <laughs> One point to Jaden. <laughs> this was not a competition. Uh, it is now. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Next one. All right. So you you suggested appealing to children. I don't know. Who else do we need to appeal to? Anime fans. Let's do that. Can I go over the line? Are they like? Yeah, we're, these are these are in the one characters series. Characters of an anime. These are characters in the same universe. Okay, so they're the main characters. Yep. Like I don't know if they're like good I don't or know, bad. Yours is but good. Yours or mine, and then the other one will be the antagonist. Maybe we'll just see in the final okay. sketches. This final yep, line art that's area. Great idea. God, we're so good at this. Man, we're such creative is, artists, geniuses. Yep. Oh, yours is like an actual person. <laughs> I don't know what to do I with like yours. I looked over to yours. I don't know what to do with yours. I was still, I was still going with shapes, and then I looked over at you and was like, "Oh, that's actually a person." <laughs> okay, I've got a monster, but it's an anime monster, so it needs like anime eyes. Yeah, I never went through the phase of drawing like super anime. No, me neither. I think I tried at one point. So, I, like, I drew characters with like anime eyes for a period of time, but they always ended up looking sort of like bastardized Disney characters anyway. So I just sort of. <laughs> <laughs> I always watch like Spongebob and stuff and yeah. oopsie, but I know they have crazy hair. That's not as crazy as it could be. <laughs> Influenced by Dragon Ball Z, this is going to be like a really muscly monster. That's a big shoulder muscle, by the way. Just that one thing is just a shoulder muscle. <laughs> oh, and he's like, hey, nice to meet you, man. <laughs> what else did they do in bit in 
anime. They have like band aids on their face. <laughs> they do. That's an anime thing, right? Yeah. And they have toast. I'm gonna and, give him toast. And blushies. He's got blushies. Enemies can't have blushies. That's too cute. Can't they? Uh, it's it's blood. Oh. From fighting. Aww. My guy's still like, here, have some bread. And he has a super V-neck. <laughs> That's not low enough. I feel like it needs to be like a V-neck. Don't want to go too far. <laughs> Can't appeal to some audiences. <laughs> What's this guy's name? Toast man. Like you think it's like, oh, he's fire, right? He's like, nope, I just give <laughs> toast. He has the power of knowing exactly where to set the toast like dial at. And get he never toast. burns any no one toast I know. ever. Exactly. I don't even know. I've had so many different toasters. It's either undercooked or overcooked. And you put it in twice and it's always burnt. <laughs> you never just put it down and leave your toast to cook. You have to like, I feel like I'm doing a terrible stand-up routine right now. Uh, you always like end it halfway through. He just saves it. Like he just unplugs the toaster. He's like, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this guy is... Toast. He is toast? Yeah. What a plot twist. Yeah, he's got a toast head. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there's like a the, the past thing, like he had a toast son and then he burnt it and or like this guy <laughs> burnt it and he's like, my son, I will, I'll never forgive you. And then he trained for like a thousand years. So it's, it's a uh, toast man versus the, the mighty toast. This could totally be an anime. Copyrighted. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a burnt face. They, they don't count as blushies because they're burn marks. What if like this guy, he put him in the toaster for too long and then he mutated into like, he's like, I want revenge, father. <laughs> <laughs> he's holding his son. Daddy, help me. <laughs> oh no, he looks so cute and sad. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the That's real good. villain here? Maybe that should be a poll. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. I mean, All right. I feel like we've so definitely we appealed to anime fans. And toast. I feel like we've almost appealed to everyone. There's gotta be so one more at least. Think about it. Uh, thumbnail clickbait. We what? have to appeal to the girls. That's true. We need some nice lady bait. <laughs> Yes. Wait, hang on. Who won that last one? I think that was a group effort that we just did really well on. Well, but I'll just draw a point in the middle. Yeah. <laughs> Half a tally for both. Yeah. It's lady time. Appealing I'm, to the ladies. Uh, mm, crap. I've never had to appeal to the ladies. <laughs> I've, I literally have no idea why my wife married me. I'm not kidding you. I like sort of sponged free cheeseburgers off of her before we were dating. <laughs> had like this big scraggly beard. So I don't know, obviously I have a great personality, but. That's all it takes. And a bunch of hearts because they're so cute. What are girls like? Girls, girls, girls don't like boys. Girls like cars and money. <laughs> and girls will laugh at boys when they're not funny. Remember, you just laughed. Does that mean I'm not funny? Oh, come on. Ah. I feel like there we're we also really appealing to good Charlotte fans here. We're doing so well. Is that a movie? Good Charlotte made that song. Oh. I don't know anything about anything. This is a tower of money. The tower of money. All only girl employees work there. But you know what? This is my attempt to appeal at women based on a, a, a punk song from the, the early 2000s. So you as a real life girl should probably <laughs> fix mine. Um, and I'll just see if I can in any way use yours as a foundation to make something appealing. I, I'll fix it up, don't worry. I feel like you've made this really easy for me. This is the ideal, uh, boyfriend. What are you doing? What? What? I'm just, what's wrong? I'm just, I just is looked over like- Is this not appealing? I'm just, I don't know how to appeal to women. I don't know what you were in the middle of drawing, but it looked very strange to me. It's a, it's a, the boyfriend. I thought he's got, he's old fashioned, so he's got these fluffy pants. He's a great cook, so look, he's a little bit overweight, but you know, he's got a great personality. <laughs> Everyone likes uh, a guy with no shirt. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I see where you're going. Continue. <laughs> that is the face of beauty. Like every <laughs> girl wants him. <laughs> he needs to be more manly, so I'm gonna just add some facial hair. Oh yeah, it's so manly. Actually, I'm gonna get rid of the mustache. I've heard <laughs> um, that women really like neck beards because then their face is like soft up here to kiss and stuff. Like it's all like nice and gentle. But you but still get the, the manly the, look yeah, of exactly. a beard. <laughs> There's like masculinity still. Like I learned that from Ethan from H3H3's recent video. Oh yeah, he's, of course. He's rocking the neck beard. So I thought- I mean, he's married, so he would know. Is he married to Hila? Yeah. 
cool. I like them. They're like the best YouTube couple ever. They are. All right, this is Ethan. Because <laughs> this is him. Obviously, he appeals to. Oh to yeah, me. he's got the the fupa and the neck beard. Yeah. He's got everything. Yeah. And maybe I can just draw Ela here. He's driving <laughs> over to him. He's got a vape. You gotta have it. Gotta have that vape. The vape nation, y'all. All right, these are uh, sexy Ethans in the background with angel wings. <laughs> I didn't it's know what amazing. shapes you drew, so I had to try and make it work somehow. It's just hurts because what? girls love Oh, hurts. no. <laughs> oh, I knew I got it. No, you turned it into, in, into something Did I? Even better. Is this, is this still appealing to the ladies? <laughs> I think so. Okay, good. I think this was very successful. I think that's it. I think we have genuinely ticked every- I've never made a set of videos like the ones we've made today that have appealed to literally everyone on the planet except for people who love animals. Wait, I can fix it, I can fix it. Can you? Yeah, wait, let me just- there's just a bunch of dogs. There we go. And he's- right. the dog's got a vape. <laughs> That's still animal cruelty. No, he's having fun. <laughs> We're done! That's every single demographic we've appealed to. I am so proud of us. Uh, this is YouTube history. And, on top of all that, it's family friendly. Except for this. Wait, I need a- uh, he needs like... Sensor bar. Um, <laughs> Quickly. Yeah, okay. okay there we're we safe. go. Fam now the parents are happy. <laughs> All right. That's it. That was that was incredible. For those of you who haven't seen it, go check out Jaden's channel where we where we got this ball rolling, uh, mm -hmm. the, the history making ball. And of course, subscribe if you haven't, because Jaden's channel is fantastic. She does these awesome cartoons. Yeah, and this is Jazz's channel, so you probably already know, but you should keep watching his videos. <laughs> to Good get job. More quality <laughs> content like this <laughs> all right thanks for watching guys Bye. see you later make sure to subscribe to my channel to see more of my videos and while you're at it check out my shop where i sell ebooks brushes photo references video courses and more there's another video you might enjoy from my channel over there and you can also check out my behind the scenes daily vlog channel daily jazza that's it for now and until next time i'll see you later